Hey guys, Trapper John coming at you with another Diablo 4 video. All right, so on this one, we're gonna jump right into it. Uh, this is gonna be kind of a longer video. So what I did is uh, I had a lot of people who asked me in our Discord server, Aftershock United, about uh, at what point, like how hard was Capstone Dungeon, John? Did you struggle? What would you recommend? Uh, obviously, I had my beginner guide, but I went ahead and I, you know, I decided I'll just record me doing the Capstone Dungeon uh, to at least unlock Nightmare 3. Uh, we can kind of see the difficulty, uh, talk about a couple of my builds. I would go through and I just kind of show you what I got going on, what I don't have going on. Um, I actually did the Capstone Dungeon four levels below the recommended of 50. It wasn't that bad. And as you can see here, if I go to the, if I pull up the uh, map here and go look at the renown, nope, not there. Uh, you can see up here in the top left, Fraction Peaks, I am at Nightmare 3. Currently, what I'm trying to do is get my Renown up, get these all done, so that way I can start getting prepared for the Paragon boards. Uh, because just like in my other videos that I was talking about, it's very advantageous to get all these extra skills, all these extra Paragon points before you keep leveling, just to make your leveling process so much faster and easier and better. Um, but yeah, that's gonna go ahead and do it for this intro. Stay tuned. I'm gonna go ahead and play the footage. This will basically be me coming all the way through the Capstone Dungeon so you can see the difficulties, what I did, what worked, what didn't work. And yeah, hopefully that helps you. Enjoy the video. All right, so let's go ahead and let's dive into the uh, first capstone dungeon of Diablo 4. This will be my first attempt at it. I'm currently level 46. Uh, basically, just a real quick recap of where I'm at before starting here. Uh, we have all the altars found in uh, Fractured Peaks. We have gotten a lot of them in Scots Glen. The reason why I did that is because I wanted to get these two additional skill points, two additional skill points. If I fail, I'm gonna go get the other skill points here and uh, try to get those all knocked out because obviously those definitely help. Um, build wise i'm doing pretty good actually i don't have any points not allocated that i don't desperately need for my build my build's pretty solid at the moment so i think we're gonna be okay the only thing i wish i had a little bit a couple more points in is maybe puncture uh or even the uh shroud because i did go ahead and pick up the extra movement speed that could potentially help me but overall in general i i'm hoping we're gonna be okay i think i'm gonna take my own advice and it's gonna go okay <laughs> i guess we're gonna we're about to find out Okay, click collect animus from Revan Knight. Okay. Let's see how it is, how it goes. This is either gonna be really easy, hard. Let's find out. Ooh, not starting off great. Okay. Keep in mind, I also don't have any of the uh, legendary aspects that I really want for this build at all. Um, so I am going in completely off of uh, skills right now and uh, abilities. Mm, this is definitely a lot harder. They are level 50, obviously. significantly harder. There's a good chance I don't complete this one. We definitely got killed the Inquisitor, though. This thing has got to go, man. Okay. And boom. It's quite funny, because as I was working on that one, my Shadow Clone was taking this one on. Okay, it's dead. All that, and I didn't get any animus? Well, that's scary. Why these Inquisitors are annoying, man? I 
Okay, I wish I had one more skill point for the crit, the heal on crits. I wish I would have had just that. I think that would give me enough counter heal. Okay. Boom, did it. That one anyways. Okay, so it looks like there's gonna be a few of them. Hmm, not good. Keep moving. I usually don't kill everything in, uh, in a row. Like usually I just try to skip to the objective and then cluster. Uh, definitely can't do that for this, this because uh, their stats are way too high. Need more time. And let's get into it. There we go. I think I'm getting a little more used to the uh, difficulty. Poison damage and he's good. Got him. Fuck! Didn't mean to open that. This thing is gonna die. Like, you've got to go, buff, bro. Poison damage is just too OP. I mean, clearly, that's why I'm using it. But, like, this guy. There he goes. No, he's dead. Okay. Your shield's annoying. This skills deal up to 20% increased damage based on your available primary resource when cast. Receiving the maximum benefit when you have full primary resource. Interesting. Okay, so. Flurry damages enemies in a circle around you and deals. Yeah, but I'm not using flurry, right? Like, I'm not using that skill, so that's useless. Yep. Okay, so which one's that? That one? So let's just swap it out for that one. Yep. 
Okay. Good to go there. Uh, yep. That one we don't need. Okay, I think we're good. Moving on. There's another one right here. Let's kill this thing first, though. Okay, or we're just gonna start on the boss. That's fine, too. Oh, yeah. And the extra damage definitely came into play just now. That was cool. That was a good drop. Definitely feel the uh, slight increase in my damage when my resource bar is higher. Yeah, that feels much, much better, actually. Cool. Um, Down. Yep, down, down. Let's go. That's a massive upgrade of over double your damage. Yeah, I would say it feels very, very, very good. So... That was a very lucky drop. I need more time. Okay, so I guess I gotta go down. Oh, I would have thought one of the bosses would have been in this area. Okay, I guess not. That's what I get for thinking. Come on. Teleporters. Yeah, that's right. You die when you come out. And boom. Ah, oh, fuck. <gasps> Damn it. I had the healing potion too. I just didn't have. I, I clicked late. I'm not ready yet. Quick late. Hold on. Let's check uh, inventory consumables. Uh, yeah. Yep. The armor and thorns is probably nice, nicest for me right now. I need more time. Let's try to get rid of some of the trash mobs, like pull like so that way it's just the big guys to fight. You know what I mean? Like make the fight a little bit more manageable. I think that's probably going to be my smartest option. So it looks like I'm going to have to fight one more Revenant Knight, maybe one more after. I don't know. It's going to be close. It's maybe the last one. We'll have to see. Brandon just logged in on the Diablo Force. Bar gang will activate. Let's go. Saw the bat signal. There we go. That's better. I still can't believe I ripped. Like the fight wasn't that bad. Just, I guess resource management, right? Is what it comes down to. Oh, it's because that wasn't the right one. It's this one. 
There we go. It's this one that fucked me up. Ah! You about fucked me up again. Run like a little bitch. What? Uh, oh, I must not have good resistance on lightning. I will have to take a look at it after this fight. I may not have good uh, resistance on lightning right now. We got him. Let's see. Um, I don't, I really wish the resistances were listed right here because they're pretty important. Uh, lightning is a 42. Cold is actually my weakest, really. Weird, okay. Uh, no. Well, I guess I'm gonna go into final battle. The capstone damage is what you want to see over resistance. Okay. I need more time. It's fair. Okay, so let's go up here. We're gonna try to see if we can't reacquire more orbs. That way we get a full set of them before the last boss fight. Hopefully I don't need it, right? But in the event that I do. I hate those inquisitors. That makes me feel better. Where's his boss? He's dead. I do like the amount of damage I do with freaking poison. It's just insane. Right, so it looks like the boss is up here. Yep. Boss is up here. Okay, let's go. Need more time. Oh shit! Why are there so many? Okay, this isn't ideal. Oh shit. Okay, well, this is different. This is the one I was expecting. I got one. Yeah, he's gonna go down. Cool. Take out this one because he's a caster. Those are always annoying. I want to leave the big bulky fucker for last if I can. They're easier to navigate around. See, and yeah, because I didn't kill him first, the uh, one dude was able to survive. Okay, so this fight seems to be manageable as long as I don't take a whole lot of pointless hits like I just about did. Dude. Fuck off with your fucking lightning. Yeah, you die. Die as quickly as possible, please. 
Thank you. Now we're doing, now we're doing things. Now I think we're beating this. Alright, we're almost there. And GG. Got him. That wasn't too bad there. fight been going on it feels like forever 20 minutes wow okay i definitely gotta edit this video this is a long fight seems ridiculous I legit have to kill every single person in this fight this is a mistake get out of there this is a long epic fight right here like this is worse than the boss fight was mainly just because of the numbers are annoying Damaging a chilled or frozen enemy with shadow imbued. Useless. I don't use either of those. Wow. Yep. All the enemies still to kill. Jesus, man. All right. I guess we'll just work away from the bottom. Start from the bottom. Now we're here. Getting no views on the YouTubes. <laughs> uh, today's video, I got a total. It's like 60 views for two YouTube videos. It's great. It's a great day. So, all right, come on. Let's go here. Yeah, this is a hell of a long fight. Like, they should have put a disclaimer like, hey, this fight could take X amount of time. Okay. Uh, I didn't notice that the explosion barrel there. That could have been helpful. Another one. Come on, follow. Come on. Yes. 
guess you can hurt them better. Like that worked out pretty okay. They just hurt him in there. Boom. Okay. I mean, that helped knock out this little section a lot quicker, to be honest. To be fair. To be fair. Alright, so let's go here. I really didn't have to slay him all, did I? I just really just got to kill this guy. Did you guys literally just let me do this fight? Like, following the rules, killing everything, when really I probably just have to kill this guy and be done with it? Is that what just happened here? Oh, no, I didn't. I it's still killing things. Okay, just kidding. Alright, never mind. Disregard. Still gotta kill all the rest of this stuff, apparently. done. Probably actually be pretty OP in this section, I think. Because since they do such a good job of following you, you could easily do like a Caltrox and Poison Trap build and probably kill this faster than what I am currently. At least with the current gear I have. Problem is, is every freaking legendary I get is some sort of modifier for grenades. I don't know why. Like, I don't even think grenades are a uh, very heavily um, built thing in... Uh... Ooh! Come on. Still gotta go up. Up. Okay. Bummer. I thought it was done. Uh, travel to the curator's chamber. Okay. Okay, cool. So maybe we're done. Ah, oh, fuck me. Bro, you better just die quick. Fuck off. Ouch. Okay, let's go. Alright, we're moving, we're moving, we're moving. Need to wait for poison to come up and my ultimate to come up at the same time. Looks like that'll be in any second. Ah! Fuck. 
damn it. Twice I've died this this uh this capstone dungeon. The first time was my was totally my fault. This last one was unpreparedness is what this was. Dang it. Well, good thing I will not play in hardcore. That would have been rough. Okay. actually hurting me a lot in this fight. Come on. A little bit more damage. Almost there. Almost there. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on. There it is. We got him. He's dead. Well, that was rough. Well, at least we got some, some Legos, right? Jeez, that was rough. All right. Well, let's see. Take a look. So, whatever penetrator, I'm not using that one. Uh, it's frozen, not using that either. Pants. Uh, which one are these? These are sovereigns. You take less damage from crowd-controlled enemies. Whenever a crowd-controlled enemy deals direct damage, you gain movement speed. Um. I don't know. I guess this one's kind of a toss up. Um, each stack of momentum key passive helps heal you for. Because um, that's kind of that momentum key passive is. Um, do I have that? I can't remember. I don't like that I can't actually search. I've missed POE already. I don't know. Oh, there it is. Yeah, m m yeah. I do already use momentum passive. Okay. And that's what's keeping me healed right now. So that's kind of helpful. So those are probably useless as well. All right, that's fine. 
Check the world tier statue. Okay. Get me out of here. Let's go. We did it, Ricky. We did it. Let's go change it to tier three. Call it a day. Then we can actually start doing stuff. All right. Let's go. About to be a real boy. I'm not ready yet. And there it is. Uh, sacred items and unique items can drop. Nightmare sigils can drop. Teletides can appear across sanctuary. Champion monsters with damage resistance auras can appear. Awesome. Let's go. Terminates all active portals. Resets. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's go. We did it, ladies and gentlemen. We are officially... Nightmare tier. Let's go. All right. So overall, um, I would say that fight was good. It was a little challenging. Uh, obviously, level 46. I definitely think if you did not watch my uh, basics for dummies video, the beginner guide that I made, um, I guess you probably could have done it without it, so to speak. But it did definitely help. I followed my own advice and was able to make it through. Obviously, I did die the twice. The first time was 100% my own fault. Um, that was just bad gameplay by me, not a, not a build thing. The second time I died was kind of a build thing slash uh, mechanical error. Like, just not paying attention right to the mechanics uh, and getting out of the way of the AoE damage that he did it. That's why I died the second time. So... I think overall, in general, Capstone Dungeon, it was significantly harder. Like, don't get me wrong, it was nothing like a normal dungeon. Uh, it was very hard, very challenging, but very enjoyable. It felt kind of rewarding. Uh, the, the last portion we had to kill all the enemies, that was dumb. But you know what? It's okay. Uh, we still enjoyed it. We had fun. And uh, we got quite a bit of XP as well, because we, I think we started that Capstone Dungeon at, what, like 46? And we got over half a bar of XP not too bad overall in general but yeah definitely say i would enjoy it good luck to all of you out there i'm gonna go progress a nightmare now all right catch you guys in the next one peace